I want to say, why I'm in a vex? But my baby father a vex, yeah. My daughter a vex on a blood clot. <laughs> Welcome back to August with the Shade. Make sure that you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel. And listen, don't forget to leave your comments down below because you know we love to get things popping in the comments. You know what I'm saying? And if you're not a member of this channel, go ahead and hit that join button so that you can become a member and get all the tea first. Period. Okay? Now, the first thing that I want to do is get into Miss Carisha. Uh, oh, my bad. She don't like to call her. We can't call her Carisha, y'all. We got to call her Young Miami. So, Young Miami and Puff Daddy. Oops. Damn, we can't call him Puff Daddy. We got to call him Diddy, right? <laughs> They were cozied up in somebody's VIP. They were drinking and, you know, having a good time. And this is not the first time that we have seen Young Miami and Diddy cozy up. You know what I'm saying? So, what's the game? Y'all fucking a what? Because we want to know. Because for me, it looks like Carisha's been a little lonely while JT been over there, you know, booed up with her Leo boot. You know what I'm saying? Getting all the love and attention. And I feel like Carisha feel left out. So, I feel like she's out here just playing the field, just trying to date and look, you know, because this looks very PR-ish. You know what I'm saying? It looks like... Whatever label they're on, they're like, yo, listen, y'all already flopping. I'm going to need you to get with somebody, and I'm going to need you to make some noise quickly because twerkalator ain't popping no more. What you got? And I'm sorry, those weak-ass lives with you and Santana, they no longer work for you anymore. You're going to have to come with talent now. You can no longer get on live and make yourself viral anymore. Now she's going around taking pictures with Diddy and acting like she is cozy up with an alleged straight man. Okay, you better look at Kim Porter's life. You better look at a lot of. You better look at Cassie. Look at all of the girls that he's been with in the past. Watch yourself, girl. That's all I'm gonna tell you. Because young Miami, I do not think that this is a great move for you. But if you're happy and you feel like you're doing your thing, do what you need to do, my mom. Because right now, if you're happy and you're living your life and you know, I guess having fun, then have fun. But all I'm gonna say is watch yourself because you know Kim Porter, everybody else that they have been, he has been entwined with. It didn't end so well. You know what I'm saying? As soon as Cassie left him, she was able to have her baby and actually be happy. So I don't think that P Diddy brings happiness to anyone's life because. He owes so many people, he has messed up so many careers, and now he said he has a black five-year plan for us. Chad, I'm done. I'm over it, I'm over it. But I really wonder what JT feels about this. Like, are you really just trying to get with another rich man so that you can make your friend a little mad? Ooh, looks like a little competition to me. What you guys think? Let's get the discussion popping in the comments. Don't forget to leave your like, and don't forget to leave your comments. Do you think that Carisha is dating P. Diddy to make JT and little Uzi mad? Let me know, because we really will get things popping in the comments. I'm going to actually answer some of the comments, okay? Love y'all, I'm out.